little bit of jockeying and sportsmanship on the field. Yep, things get a little salty early. I think the biggest thing, Rich, is in a game of this magnitude, everybody's amped up. Just settle in. Can that emotion be your enemy? Well, I, I think there are certain positions that have to lasso that a little bit and keep it to... If you're at quarterback, you can't afford to get caught invested in this rivalry as Kyle would Sorensen to kick it away. Reed will put a knee down. BYU won the toss and deferred. Brian Johnson. Four wide receivers set on second and six. Pass is caught. Jeremy Brooks has it still on his feet up to the 48-yard line. Brandon Howard pulled him down from behind. Receivers, quarterback Brian Johnson will just stand up, deliver the short passing game, continue to move the sticks. Johnson throws, touchdown to Castile. Recognizes this time that he's got Castile working outside on a linebacker underneath. And it goes right to where that opening is. Yeah, Castillo gets into the seam. I'm not even sure what they're reviewing here. I guess they're looking to see if he had to. Johnson complete to Castillo. He'll get 11. Bauman shoved him out of bounds. And which means if BYU wins here today, there would be a three-way tie for the Mountain West Conference Championship. A Utah victory means they remain unbeaten and claim the title outright. Johnson on second and 12. Throws a jump to the five. Wheeled in by Brown. Direct snap. Finds a crease in the end zone. Touchdown. And beat, uh, Utah's offensive line is pushing BYU back big time. You see Slaughter off with the pole. He didn't even need the pole because Asiata went back where he... Cougars rush four. Castillo slips the tackler and gets to the 37. <laughs> and, Rich, I did make him take me through a, uh, through a coffee shop. Yeah. He has to have that double, triple, whatever it is that gets him going. <laughs> Trust me. And I, then you want him out of your car as soon as he drinks it. I, uh, I got rid of that duty a long time ago. Sakota trying to give Utah the lead. King. On third down, floater. This one's intercepted. Joe Dale, his second of the year. field goal Johnson lets it fly sideline route pass is caught by Brown Johnson going to take a shot he's got Reed touchdown adjustment to the ball and catch Watch, watch David Reed on the on the right side, and Brian Johnson puts that football in a perfect position. I, it looked like that left foot was down to me. It looked like it was inbounds and down, and that left foot looked like he had control of the ball, like the left foot was down. I think that that one is going to stand, and, and Reed is a guy that that they have. Cole trying to apply a little pressure, unable to get there. This is intercepted. Intercepted by Johnson. And a misread, a misread that time. Max Hall thought he had one-on-one -on -one Now watch the help over the top. R.J. Stanford had the coverage. It was a perfect situation. Robert Johnson, the safety, comes up over the top. It's going to be interesting to see. Does he come down? He the question is, down. does he come down in bounds? And he gets his left foot down right there. I think there. It, that is an amazing an play. Oh, look at the run. Lost the football. That's all trying to escape, trying to get away from the pressure, and he sticks it up. He's trying to get escape that pressure, and the ball gets jarred loose before 
He hits the ground. Heads up play by Paul Krug. Koamisi right there. Jars, jars the football loose. And then Johnson to Brown to the 16. First down. Orchestrated just this year against Air Force, against Oregon State, and TCU. Castillo far side breaks the tackle to the pylon. Touchdown, Utah. Castile with the catch and the swing that slides to the right. Intercepted by Kruger. Falls down at the five. The three turnovers, Asiata. Going to throw to the back of the end zone. Caught. Touchdown, Chris Japu. And here's the touchdown. And you know, you, Asiata runs the ball 98% of the time. You, you try to play those, those odds, but and you have to get safeties up in there and linebackers up in there to try to defend that. Checked out, picked up by Smith. But you can't go there late. Okay. You've got to throw that throw on the break. Max Hall was reading to his left. He wanted to go to Michael Reed on the fade route to the corner of the end zone. He came back late. The ball was thrown late. And Smith is too good at corner to throw the ball late on. But they have an opportunity to end this ball game. Five turnovers for BYU. Matt. First down, Utah. Diddy. Fourth and goal. Johnson. Flips. Touchdown, Colt Sampson. And if you're BYU, you have to gamble a little bit. You have to step up in there, and you have to you choose. Are you going to play the run? You're going to play the pass. BYU chose to play the run. Opportunity to be part of it. What a wonderful college football atmosphere. Another interception. Joe Dale. Puts your rival. It's always about the turnovers and the field position and special teams. Look at Kyle Winningham. Look at his guys come up. He's going to get the Gatorade shower. He doesn't know it yet. They're getting, they're going to sneak in and they got him right there. Andy was trying to warn yeah. him. Andy <laughs> Ludwig was like, hey, something's... And all the things that they've gone through with when they're conditioning and spring football. And look at the fans piling out on the field. I, I, I've, been down, I've been down there in this, and I'm wishing the best of luck to Sandy. <laughs> it's to Toby down there. I'm glad I'm up here. Brian Johnson, 30... And when you get to a huge rivalry game, and when you do what we do, people always ask. There we go. That is going to kill it. What a sight. Congratulations to the University of Utah and their coaching staff and their players. Second time in school history they've gotten to 12-0. They'll try to win their eighth straight bowl game in a BCS game. You know, coming into this, Rich, we, we've talked all week, and the coaches both on both sides told us turnovers will be the thing. Turnovers will win this game or lose this game. And we felt if a team was plus two, they'd run, run away with this game. Agreed. And, and, and plus six, you're really going to run away with this game. DCS found indeed.